Yeah. yeah. Kind of a reddish kind of diamond back. He is uh, warming every bit he can. It's a little chilly out, and we're gonna keep on cruising. Look at this little teeny weeny 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 baby Trimorphodon Lambda, Sonoran Lyre Snake. This is actually cruised by Steve and Jeremy and Chris a little while ago, and they're letting us release it up here on top of the mountain. But this is the smallest Lyre Snake I've ever seen. Dick got envenomated. He's over there talking about how he got envenomated. All right, we're, we're leaving now. I'm gonna go cruise some more roads. And we're out of here. <laughs> All right, man. Okay, we stopped for a teeny little. Oh, oh, he's leaving. Teeny little glossy snake. Micro glossy. It is that time of year. All right, there's a car coming. So I am gonna put this guy off the road. All right, guy, just cruised up this scutulatus. Oh, he's moving. It's hard to pick up on my light, but it's really, really quite green. Maybe I can put this a little warmer. Mojave rattlesnake. This is a youngish one, too. Only got a about half grown. Your light is cool. Where are you going? Don't fall on me. Uh, Will? Look at Dick. Look at him. What are you doing? You doing? You gonna do the crab apple skippy dance? Crab apple two step. The green apple. The green the apple two. Step. Well, this guy is green, so. He's really close to my foot. Okay, I'm getting away from that. Guy. There we go. All right, let's go cruise some other stuff. You got you got photos? You good? All right, we're gonna head on down the road and see what else we can find. Let's go, that was a chicken bone. All right, Mojave numero dos for tonight. I'm gonna watch him as he goes off the road. See ya, buddy. <laughs> I'm gonna go up under there. And he's going. A hog -nose skunk. We got a hognose skunk right here. Did you hit? Are you good? He's laying on a little blanket. Or is that a thong? He's like laying on a thong or something. Yeah, so Bunches of scoots. Now we got a diamond back. gonna fall him up the road I guess. <laughs> there you go. This is really bright I gotta put this down a little bit. This is our I don't know how many numbers but this is several. Oh 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 Western Diamond back. There's a car coming. Might just be the highway. Whoa, look at that two-step. Cool. Cool, man. Oh, geez, look at him go. <laughs> That's cute. Good. Okay. We are headed back to the hotel. Good morning, everybody. This is the morning of our sixth day out here. And this morning, I am hiking up a canyon. I, I tried to get here at the crack of dawn, or actually the little before, and that failed. I hit the snooze, snoozed it up pretty good. But I'm going to hike it anyway, even if the sun comes up. 
um, hoping that it'll still be a little cool because right now it's nice. Don't want to end up like the last time. That was my good luck Harry Potter owl. Oh man, I don't know how I got down in here. Oh crap. <laughs> I, uh, I came down from up there, but uh, it's easier to go this way, I think, to get out of here. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh. Shoot, I don't know if I can get through here. If I can get through here at all. Oh shit. Oh God. Fat butt got stuck in there almost, like a Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> all right. All right, so I'm almost done walking this canyon. I'm sorry that, uh, that was boring for you. There was no snakes involved. Let's kind of just show you what it's like to hike one of these canyons. That's the dealio. I'm gonna hike back up to the road and see if Dick's gonna come pick me up. All right, I'll keep you posted. <laughs> so we were cruising last night and we did get a few snakes. It was a very windy road, so we didn't have much time to like really photograph in the road or anything like that because there's just traffic and everything like that. So we collected the snakes to photograph them in the morning and uh, that's what we're doing this morning. We're gonna let them go exactly where we found them, but we got a patch nose snake and a baby at that. These guys are pretty common up here. We're up in the high desert, but they're common throughout the high and the mid elevation deserts and uh, in the woods, even the woodlands. But uh, this guy right here, feisty. So we photographed him and we're gonna let him go exactly where we found him last night and uh, get him on his way. All right, I'm putting him out here. I don't know what's going on with my camera. I think it's like setting some kind of blue mode. I don't know, everything seems blue, right? All right, we're gonna put him right here and send him on his way. And we got a little Sonoran Liar. It is indeed, it's a very beautiful one. Rattle his tail. Patriotic white elephant, the heffalump. <laughs> no, I don't know what those are, Jake. They're not cardinal, and they're not in you. Oh my God, guys! Oh my God, I got a green rat right here. Look, look at this, guys. Oh my God, my heart. Hang on, hang on. Are you kidding me? Hang on, I gotta calm down for a sec. We just came upon a green rat snake and I am, I'm shaking. I am shaking. All right, we're gonna photograph this guy and get some good pictures. Hang on a sec, Whew, take some breaths. All right, man. What a beauty. All right, now that I've calmed down a little bit, we're gonna come down here and do a little session with this guy. Green rat snake. All right. We've been looking for these guys for so long. So long. And then, one day, it just appears. There you go. This was my white whale out here, man. Green rat snake, triaspis. They don't get much cooler than this, to me, to me. If, if you know me, I'm a huge rat snake fan. Weak wet, man, it may started off slow, but guess what, man? This right here is a good way to end it. Green rat, oh my goodness, how awesome.
Okay, okay guys, you're never gonna believe this. This is number two, green rat snake. Holy crap. <laughs> oh my God. Two, we just got one. Dick's being angry because I don't know why. He got something really cool and uh, he's in all grumpy over here. We're taking pictures of this guy in situ right here on the road. This one's a little nicer. No scarring on it, but it is kinky. This is a great time of night. It's like five o'clock in the evening. R roughly five o'clock, I'd say. Um, sun is out, it's still really warm, but oh my God. All right, here goes Dick. He's gonna go down and get him. Can you get bend over and get him? All right, this is the, the official first hands-on. We just got, oh my God. Oh. <laughs> Hadn't seen one, now we've got, two, we've seen two. <laughs> got head, oh, he got you, he got you. <laughs> you got a little bite on him, there we go. Little nibbles. Wow, this one was much more strikey. Wow. Yeah, you might say that. <laughs> We're gonna photograph him now and I'll probably pull him on the side of the road and photograph him and see if we can find another one. Let's go, see if we can find number three. Oh yeah, nice W diamond, W diamond back, W diamond back, Western diamond back, Nick. Okay. He's going off the road. All right, it's our first snake. It's a little chilly, 73 degrees. We're gonna keep on cruising. Now we're coming across our second snake, a large, large diamond back. Another diamond back. All right, we're gonna let this guy get off the road, and we're gonna keep on cruising. We're gonna find something else. Let's go. There's nothing else to see tonight. Texas toe is on the menu. Hope you guys don't like king snakes and other snakes because Texas toads is all we got. <laughs> all right, we got another diamond back. This one's a monster. Big boy. Definitely knows we're here. Cool. Yeah, man. Yeah, so nice. All right, she just crawled off the side of the road and literally just coiled up like a cow patty right here on the side, just perfect for us to do what we do. Photographs and a little bit of footage here. I'm gonna take some pics. We're gonna get going again. Desert King. He was crossing right about in the road, middle of the road over here a little while ago, and he's, as you can see, he's pretty cold and chilly. But hey, look, we got one. And believe it or not, I have not seen one of these. I'm a live one. So this is a lifer for me on this trip. This is another lifer. And I'm okay with that, because this is an awesome snake. Check it out, man.